to get the free notes of electrical circuits check the link in the comment section and install the app for free superposition theorem question find the value of current i here in this circuit we have to find the value of current i by using superposition theorem solution first of all let's consider this 5 volt voltage source and turn off all other sources so step number 1 is to consider 5 volt voltage source and turn off all other sources turn off all other sources now here in this circuit when we turn off this voltage source then it will be a short circuit and this current will be i prime now we can find i prime by using current division rule so here we can write by using current division rule so here we can see this current i before that we have to find this current we have to find this current i so we will write this later first step is to find the value of this current i so i is equal to v by r the value of voltage here in this circuit is 5 volt and the value of resistance now here we can see this 2 ohm and 3 ohm are connected in parallel and it is connected in series with this 1 ohm and 2 ohm so it will be like this 2 ohm plus 1 ohm 2 ohm plus 1 ohm plus this 2 ohm and 3 ohm are connected in parallel so it will be 3 multiplied by 2 divided by 3 plus 2 so if we solve this so we get 5 divided by 2 plus 1 plus 3 into 2 divided by 3 plus 2 so it will be let's say it is 25 by 21 25 divided by 21 ampere now we can easily find the value of i prime so again by using current division rule i prime is equal to this i prime is equal to this current i multiplied by parallel branch resistance the parallel branch to this is 2 ohm so it will be 2 divided by 2 plus 3 ohm the value of current i is 25 by 21 25 divided by 21 multiplied by 2 divided by 2 plus 3 so if we solve this so we get 25 divided by 21 multiplied by 2 divided by 2 plus 3 so it is 10 divided by 21 10 divided by 21 ampere this is the value of i prime now next step is to find current caused by this 4 volt so again let's copy this circuit from here let's copy this circuit from here and consider step number 2 is consider 4 volt voltage source and turn off all other sources all other independent sources or directly all other sources because here there is no dependent source present so when we turn off this voltage source then it will be a short circuit and now this time this current will be i double prime let's say now before finding this i double prime we have to find this current i let's say this is current i1 so here we can write by using by using current 
डिवीजन रूल आई डबल प्राइम विल बी इक्वल टू आई डबल प्राइम इज इक्वल टू दिस करंट दैट इज आई वन मल्टीप्लाइड बाय पैरल ब्रांच रेजिस्टेंस द पैरल ब्रांच टू दिस इज टू होम इन सीरीज विथ वन होम सो इट विल बी टू प्लस वन और डायरेक्टली वी कैन राइट थ्री डिवाइडेड बाय थ्री प्लस थ्री नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड दिस आई वन दिस आई वन विल बी वोल्टेज डिवाइडेड बाय रेजिस्टेंस सो द वैल्यू ऑफ वोल्टेज इज फोर वोल्ट फोर डिवाइडेड बाय रेजिस्टेंस वैल्यू विल बी टू होम प्लस तो टू होम प्लस देन दिस थ्री होम एंड दिस थ्री होम आर कनेक्टेड इन पैरल सो वी कैन डायरेक्टली राइट इट्स इक्विवेलेंट विल बी वन पॉइंट फाइव बिकॉज वेन सेम रेजिस्टेंस वैल्यू आर कनेक्टेड इन पैरल देन इट्स इक्विवेलेंट रेजिस्टेंस विल बी हाफ ऑफ इट सो दिस थ्री पैरल विथ दिस थ्री विल बी वन पॉइंट फाइव ओ होम सो वन पॉइंट फाइव देन मल्टीप्लाइड बाय थ्री डिवाइडेड बाय थ्री प्लस वन थ्री प्लस थ्री सो देर फोर आई डबल प्राइम विल बी फोर डिवाइडेड बाय टू प्लस वन पॉइंट फाइव मल्टीप्लाइड बाय थ्री डिवाइडेड बाय थ्री प्लस थ्री सो इट इज जीरो पॉइंट फाइव सेवन वन और वी कैन राइट ओनली फोर बाय सेवन फोर बाय सेवन एम्पियर इज द वैल्यू ऑफ आई डबल प्राइम now here we can see we have to find current i by using superposition theorem the value of the direction of this current i is downward we are considering now let's see i prime direction the direction of this i prime is also downward and the direction of this i double prime is also downward so here we can write downward so the equivalent current will be i is equal to i prime plus i double prime we are adding because both the directions are same the value of i prime is 10 by 21 so 10 divided by 21 plus i double prime value is 4 by 7 4 divided by 7 so therefore i is equal to 10 divided by 21 then plus 4 divided by 7 so it is 1.047 1.047 ampere is the value of current i so this is how we can find the value of current by using superposition theorem check the link in the comment section and install the app for free thanks for watching